To do experiment number 11, I need to pour half of the copper sulfate solution from experiment number 10 into a second test tube. And set the other one aside. Next, I need to measure one spoonful of iron filings into one of the test tubes. And then place the test tube stopper on the test in the test tube. And then shake. Vigorously. It's getting warm. And now the liquid is now clear. And the iron filings are no longer, well, iron colored. Ta da! If you take a look at the test tube's contents, you will notice that the iron filings have become covered with a red copper coating. To do experiment number 12, I am basically doing experiment number 11. However, I will be using a copper sulfate solution made from the copper sulfate included with the kit. To begin, I need to dissolve one spoonful of the blue crystals in 5 milliliters of water. Now I am going to add the one spoonful of iron filings. And shake. Interesting. The iron filings have become covered with a red copper coating. Okay. So done.